Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Before we get started, thank you to everyone who has liked and subscribed. Thank you to all my subscribers, both new and existing. Um, thank you for all the, com the comments, they're absolutely fantastic, keep them coming. Um, thank you for subscribing, and if you know anyone else that you think that might like to subscribe, please pass them the details and get them to do so. Or watch a video at least, see if they like it. As you can see, now on the bench is the C47A Skytrain. I made a start on this the other day, but somehow I've deleted it, the video that I did, so um, apologies for that. Um, didn't really do that much to be honest. Um, as you might be able to see there, this is basically where I've done, what I've done. I've, I don't know if you can see that, might be able to, dab some mask hole down the centre, which would be obviously the walkways for the the paratroopers um, and I've given it a coat of grey primer uh, put the cockpit together I've painted it just now by hand um, just the instrument panel itself um, I've put mask oil in all of the instrument dials so once that's dry I'll just pick that out um, the throttle controls and the bottom part there that's according to photographs that's got to be the cockpit green so that's what that will be um, once the black's dry that is uh, I've also put together the yokes and the wheel and there's another another lever as well but I've just gone to get the paint out to spray this the interior cockpit green um, and I found my XF71 is empty so I decided I was going to give this one a go but I don't like it it's too garish if you like to me it doesn't seem right so I'm going to have to get another XF71 um, before I do that and finish off the instrument panel um, also, as you can see there, done the two, the pilot and the co-pilot seats, and I gave the photo etch an undercoat, loads of seat belts on there, so um, just gave them an undercoat. So that's it, that's where we are at the moment guys, on that, um, not really a lot I can do now. Um, I might start assembly on some other bits I might actually start this um, on here this bulkhead wall and the other side of this one it's calling out for sky now I'm not going to do that I'm going to do it as the cockpit green I think it'll look a lot better so that's what it'll be all the reference photos that I've had a look at um, and that I've a friend of mine has sent me as well um, they all seem to be green so that's what I'll be doing and apparently flat back black down the middle I think they'll be too sort of bold so I will be doing that in 
rubber and tyres instead. Give it a little bit of a worn, more worn look, I think. So that'll be that. Then obviously fire extinguishers will be normal colours and dials and things like that. That'll all be as should be. So there we go. That's the that's the start anyway. So shall we start getting things together? I don't know whether to paint things individually and then put it together or put it together and then try and paint it. I think it probably look better if painted before assembly. So yeah, so alright then guys. Uh, we'll leave it at that for now I think. So um just a quick start up video if you like. Don't want to keep you too long. Um, hope you're liking the series so far. Uh, well, the channel, sorry, not the series. And um, hopefully I'll see you shortly in the next one. Hopefully I can get some uh, XF71 and get cracking. So hopefully see you soon. Bye for now.